Hey there, my name is Mantis, and in this video, pack my pack with me. So last night I cowboy camped, so I kept everything in my pack that I didn't need uh, for sleeping. So right now I'm just taking everything out. I like starting with an empty pack. So we're just unpacking first, setting everything out. That's my glasses case, my first aid kit, the blues and bivy bag has my electronics in it. Just prepping everything. So usually start by deflating my pillow. It's my Zen bivy pillow. Super comfortable, folded up. Oh, good morning, journeyman. It's my partner. He cowboy camped with me as well. And cowboy camping is when you just sleep under the stars without your tent. Put that in a little stuff sack. Here he is again. <laughs> Just getting situated here. Taking my sheet off of my air mattress. I keep my Zen Bivy sheet attached to the quilt. Um, oh, there goes my sleeping bag liner. And that way I can pack everything together and it just makes it easier um, both for packing and then setting up when I get to camp at night. So I'm stuffing my quilt, sheet, and liner into a Hyperlite pod. I use a Hyperlite pack and this just sits really nicely, uh, fits really nicely in the bottom of my pack. So I zip that up. It's pretty waterproof. Uh, next, I deflate and roll up my air mattress. This air mattress in particular has since been retired. The baffles popped and I replaced it with some Bivy light mattress. So there's that. Oh, bugs. And distracted by something on my foot. Okay, what's next? Grab my pack. Open it up. I use, um, it's a Gregory... I don't know what they're called, I guess water bladder with a hose. And I usually do this at night, I usually filter my water at night um, as one of my chores before bed, but we got in late last night and I guess I was feeling lazy. So here I am now filtering my water. So I put in just enough to get me to the next water source. Screw the cap on really tight. Um, there's been times where I don't screw it on tight enough and then it leaks into my bag. That's not great. So get that in there. Oops, I guess I forgot to take everything out. There's some rogue hot sauce. <laughs> but I like, again, to start with the empty pockets so that I can just pack everything nice and tight. I start at the very bottom of my pack with that Hyperlite pod that has my Zen Bivy sleeping system in it. Stuff that down. Um, I don't use a liner. My pack is pretty waterproof. And then um, everything I don't want getting wet, I have in bags, like right here. My sleeping clothes or uh, town clothes go in just a Ziploc bag. Press all the air out. My cook system goes in next. Contemplating. At this moment, I realize I had not put my contacts in yet. So they're going in. And that's my glasses case. It's actually a crystal light um, container that you can get at a grocery store. Then in goes that purple case is my health kit and then the Zen Bivy zip was my electronics no rain in the forecast so my rain jacket goes in then my clothes uh, these are my food bags i had just retired my bear can so i had some op sacks they're quote unquote uh scent free bags so that's what i'm using temporarily then in goes my puffy it's a liquid item just like the um rain jacket, so I use those to just fill in the cracks of the other less flexible items. Push everything down, then I roll down the top of my pack. Really compress it. Buckle it in, cinch it tight. Mm -hmm. And then I do the outside of my pack. So I put my headlamp. Next, I have my rain pants that I roll up and put in the bottom. Even though there's no rain, sometimes it gets really cold at night. Micro spikes, which I'm not using today, but we just went over a snowy section. Also, some waterproof gaiters, my rain mitt, um, like rain shell mittens. 
my trash bag. And it's looking pretty good. There's a few more things, but there you have it.